Captain Kadara. Standing order for all incoming ships. The port is a ceasefire zone by order of Sloan Kelly. She was head of Nexus security. Be ready for anything, and keep comms open. Should hear from our resistance contact soon. Incoming call. Patching it through. There's been a development regarding the spy, Venturev. Rendezvous at Crawler Song. Your contact's codename is Shayna. Shayna? Got it. That's one hell of a welcome sign. Exiles have stepped up their game since the revolt. Not too shabby for folk who got kicked off the station with nothing to show for it. Maybe we can get them back on our side. We know they can fight Cat. Our supplier's waiting. Come on, we're gonna be late. Do I even want to know? Nope. You can't do this. This is a home. Should have paid your protection fees then. And Sloan wonders why people join the collective. Say that again. I dare you. How are we supposed to survive out there? Not my problem. You're no better You're than late. the Nexus. Had to get Sloan's cut. Sloan's not running a fucking charity. I want to buy a gun. Kadara's honored by your presence. And your credits. Finally, the respect I deserve. Happy to oblige. Clones discount. Squishy thing like you needs protection. Got the best armor in all of Kadara. Bold claim. Let's see what you got. Everything's on the console.
piss off. You order, you pay. I said... You look like you're waiting for someone. I've got time for a drink. Shayna. But you can call me Reyes. I hate the code names. I was expecting someone more... Angaran. <laughs> the Resistance pays me to supply information. Among other things. So you're a smuggler? Your man, Venterev, was arrested by Sloane Kelly, leader of the Outcasts. Word spread about what he did to Moshe Sefa. The people are calling for his execution. And Sloane? <laughs> She's a woman of the people. I like her already. Well, she doesn't like you. She's never met me. You work for the Initiative. Sloane was part of the uprising on the Nexus. I doubt she'll give Ven up easily. I'm taking him, with or without her permission. We're gonna be friends, you and I. There might be another way to get to Ven. You work Sloan. I'll talk to the Resistance. How do I contact you if things go south? Hey! You gotta pay! Keep the change. Always do. Sam, tell me about Sloane Kelly. Before joining the Initiative as head of Nexus Security, Miss Kelly served in the Alliance with a nearly spotless record. Nearly? She was involved in multiple altercations with other officers. A hothead. Great. Sloan's inside. Mine. Focus defenses here and here. The cat have been quiet for too long. What? That's quite the throne. Should I bow? Kiss your ring? Very funny. So, what brings a Pathfinder to our humble port? Venterev. Name ring any bells? What's he to you? And don't lie to me. I need him so I can infiltrate a Ket flagship. You've obviously got no love for the Ket. I'm doing you a favor. Kadara is an Angaran port. They want Ven dead, and I want to keep them happy. This is bigger than local politics. You don't need Ven. You need his intel. Talk to him before I put his head on a spike. Ven should be judged by the Resistance, not you. I don't have time for a morality debate. Dismissed. Your Highness. Chambers are closed. Sloan's that could have gone better. Perhaps Mr. Vidal had more success. Pathfinder, over here. 
Have a nice chat? I think she likes me. <laughs> Don't worry. I found a workaround. Let me guess. It comes with strings attached. Not any new ones. Remember, Ephra wants Ven alive, so when you get inside, give him this. That'll eat through whatever Sloan's holding him in, and it can't be traced back to us. A resistance agent will be waiting to pick Ven up. Ven's intel better be worth it. <laughs> You'll be the judge of that, not me. There's a maintenance shaft around the corner, sending the access code to your Omni tool. That'll get you inside. You should be able to handle the rest. Thanks. You're a lifesaver. Literally, in Ven's case. When you're done, come to Tartarus. First round's on me. I promise. Looks like it leads to a stock room. Sam, anyone up there? No heat signatures detected. The room is clear to enter. <clears throat> what do you want? The Archon's ship. Where is it? This a new interrogation tactic? Sloan's getting lazy. I'm not with Sloan. Afra sent me. Answer my questions and I can get you back to the Resistance. So I'm trading one cell for another? This is what happens when you make deals with the bad guy. Or stay here. Sloan's sharpening up a spike just for your head. Uh, I'd rather be miserable than cock and food. Which brings us back to the Archon's ship. Where is it? I never saw it. Got my orders from a Ket transponder. But you could use its frequency to triangulate the Archon's location. Do you still have it? I buried it before I was arrested. Should still be outside the city. This is your way out of here. A resistance contact will be waiting. Don't you want to know why I did it? Why I betrayed the Moshai? Enlighten me. We're losing the war against the Ket. And still, Ephra puts my brothers and sisters in danger to protect a useless old woman. So you took things into your own hands? I made the call he wouldn't. The Archon only wanted the Moshai. I thought if I gave her up... Ah. <sighs> I didn't know what the Ket were doing to my people. You resent Ephra, so the Archon used that against you. If Ephra was a better leader... Uh, it doesn't matter. And I'll accept the consequences. Pathfinder, the communicator is buried outside the ceasefire zone. I suggest bringing a squad. Vetra, Drac, are you back from... whatever it was you were doing? Yep, our completely legitimate business deal went off without a hitch. <laughs> Benefit of being a Krogan along. Tell Gil to prep the Nomad. I need to go outside the city. You've all seen a dead body brings stability and order. Again. If you would like, Pathfinder, I could provide an analysis of the deceased.
Activating automated forward station deployment. Mining zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added them to your nav system. All right, Sam. Show me what we've got. Kadara's water is dense with sulfide minerals, the oxidation of which produces toxic streams and lakes. Never liked swimming much anyways. That is fortunate. Even the Nomad's shields cannot withstand the water's corrosive properties. The presence of monoliths suggests a vault that might reduce the acidity. However, outlaws, pirates, and other unsavory exiles inhabit Kadara's hills. The further you travel from the mountain, the more dangerous it will become. Good to know. Let's get out there. Wonder how many drunk idiots have fallen in there. Vetra, I catch PB looking at me. Frequently. PB likes new shiny things. Uh, and why not? You're genuinely interesting. The Exiles have quite a setup over there. Won't be happy to see us. Wind farm. Smart. Must be how they power Kadara port. That Exil camp has a high concentration of registered criminals, Pathfinder. seems to wipe away any sense of self. Ties to community, the past, anything. It simplifies them. Binds them to nothing but the... Pathfinder. Then to Rev claimed he buried the Ket transponder near this location. Found it. Clearly that's broken. The transponder's power source is drained. So let's juice it up. Turn it on, then Gil can work his magic. Once complete, this should provide us with the Archon's location, and in turn, Meridian's. See? We're halfway there already. Oh yeah, the hard part's totally behind us. We just received a notification that there's been a murder in Kadara Port. Murder, huh? Might be something to look into. Yes. Lovely planet. Hope we... We never leave.
What's up, Ryder? Why an emergency meeting? I didn't call it. I did. Got some disturbing news while we were on Kadara. There's some tension at the Krogan colony on Eladin. It's bad. Tension among Krogan? You don't say. I wouldn't waste your time with this if it wasn't important. We need to go. I agree. Nakmor Morda made herself overlord of the colony. It's weird. No. Our priority is the Archon. We have to remain focused on his next move. Jal's right. I know dealing with so many unknowns is frustrating, but we need to hear each other out. Well, as long as we're pitching stuff, I overheard outlaws on Kadara talking about activity in the Ramav system. No, that's the system where the Turian Golden World was supposed to be. Ramav? There aren't any viable planets there. Only an asteroid field with mining ventures run by criminals. I hear Elodin's pretty rough too. Roving scavengers with nothing to lose. Crap. No one fights harder than people with nothing to lose. But now that we have the transponder, we're so close to finding the location of Archon's ship. Our goal is to create our home here. You never know how something might fit in. Anyway, get Kalo the nav points for both Elodin and that potential Turian Golden World. We want all our options ready to go. Hey, I didn't say dismissed or meeting adjourned or anything. Meeting adjourned. As you were. Yeah? When's the last time you had a normal conversation? Uh, no. This is you trying to figure me out. Categorize oh, my... Oh, exaltation. The cat just keep asking for more trouble. Everyone really looking forward to kicking those guys in the teeth. I've got no yeah. there. Gil, here's that cat transponder. The spy used it to get his orders. What do we need from it? The location it points to. Should give us a fix on the Archon's ship. <sighs> right. It's not like there's much riding on this. Just our best chance to find Meridian. Pressure. I like that. Luckily, no matter where you go in the universe, physics still applies. Only so many ways of communicating across space. There. Give it a shot. Did you connect the... <laughs> Shit, turn it off. Careful. That is a direct line to people who want to murder everyone on this ship. Sam? I have the coordinates. The signal points to the Tafino system. We sure we want to do this? I don't know. Sometimes I think we're in over our head. <laughs> Sometimes? Here's our chance to find out. <laughs> 